all righty so today guys what we are going to do is calibrate the vivo sun ph pin four and one that they sent to me take it out of the package okay so what we've done here um they they send the powder calibration so this will be for the middle one we have the nine point eighteen for this side and a six point eight six for this side sorry guys for the camera view but we're gonna work what we got so the first step it says to calibrate the instructions that I have here. Um, gonna turn it on, open up the cap first, hit the on button. It's the first the first button, the on button. Then it says hit the mode calibration button. Just like that, you're off to the races. Enter it. And then hold the mode calibration button for six seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. It didn't do anything, guys. <laughs> this thing may be a bitch to cal calibrate. So, try it again. One, two, three, four, five, six. There we go. We calibrated, guys. Six point eight six. And turn it off. I'm sorry again for the V, you guys, uh, but you guys have to take my word for it. I can't up the camera so you guys can see it, but we'll try on the next one. We're gonna go rinse this off. Actually, we got some water here, so pour this in here. Rinse off the probe. That's one thing they don't explain to you to do. Um, make sure between calibrations, you rinse off the probe. That way it's not contaminated with the last calibration. So the next up is the 4.0. Is it 4.0? Yeah, it's 4.0 on a die. So we'll do the same thing. We'll turn it on. Do you like show in the water? Calibration for six seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six. Calibrate it. 4.0, guys. Let's move it around because I'm shaking, but 4.0. Turn it off. Rinse it off again. This 
Right off, guys. And then we're on to the 9.18. So turn it on again. Stick it in the solution. Hold the calibration button for six seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six. And it's calibrated. 9.18. Keeps moving because I'm shaking, but it's at 918. All right, you guys, turn it off. Wet it down again. Wash it off. Let that dry off, and I will come back. I'm going to grab my other pH pen, and we're going to test the calibration. I'm going to see how close it is to my Ocon pH pen. Um, we're going to get some RO water, and we're going to test it. So we'll be back. I had to give you guys some light. So I went and got my Ocon pH meter. And we have the Vivo Sun pH meter. Um, we have some distilled water here. So we're gonna go ahead and test it. Turn this on, we'll stick it in the water. See what it reads. It's backwards for me, so. Wait till it stops. I'm not sure how it's supposed to read, but. We'll just leave it in there, see where it stops at. It looks like it's reading around 5.9. So we're gonna go ahead and turn the octon one on. Stick that in there. Yeah, they're, guys, they're totally, they're totally off. Maybe I calibrated it wrong, but they're totally off. I'm still gonna post this video no matter what. Um, we have the Vivo Sun at 5.8, and we have my Octon at 7.6. It always, it's actually real tricky. So, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna take this off. Actually, put it back in there. We'll hold it. Yeah, I can see that now the Vivo Sun's even going down. So we'll let them both just do their thing. And we'll come back and see. And here we have it. We just had the octon stop. Um, we shake it around in the water. We kind of mix the water up a little bit. It's 5.5 and 5.7. I do have a PPM meter that I'm going to test as well to see if they're how accurate they are. Um, but we don't know, you guys. Um, they, they advertise a lot of products, Vivo Sun does, and you know they offer a refund for testing. I'm gonna write my review. Again, it could be uh, person error, so I'm gonna make sure I get it calibrated right because this is a pH meter that I'm going to be using. I love the fact that it's four in one. This, my Octon pH meter only tells the temperature and the pH. I had to get a separate meter for EC um in ppm so i love the facts you can see how the vivo sun's coming up now um so i love the fact that it's four in one so tds ec ph and temperature on here temperatures are roughly fairly close 21 celsius to 22 celsius um just a point off so i'm thinking that we're pretty good here we're, we're, we're doing pretty good here um I love it, Vivo Sun. I love most of you guys' products. I love the isolating fan. Even one went out on me, but I love you guys. We're here to talk about the pH pen. 
I recommend getting this form one pH print. Those are last words from Colorado Green Cheese, and we are out with the testing of the Vivo Sun 4-in-1 meter. Thank you.